Right now, the now Mayor Sly James working hard to get Amazon's attention, and he needs your help. Kansas City, one of the many cities now vying for Amazon's second headquarters. Okay, so check out this video the mayor posted on social media just about an hour ago. How do I get Amazon to take notice of Kansas City? Product reviews. I live in beautiful Kansas City where the average home price is just $122,000, so I know Lux Living doesn't have to cost a ton. That's why at $14.99, these wind chimes are music to my ears. They have a soothing timber, and they catch the wind just as beautifully as those far more expensive models. <laughs> so here's the deal. Mayor James bought a thousand items on Amazon, and he's leaving a review of each item with references to all of the great things about Kansas City, like, as you just heard, our affordable <laughs> housing. And he's asking for everyone to tweet Amazon with the hashtag KC five stars all to let the company know why it should choose Kansas City for its second headquarters. You can read more on the mayor's reviews of our website on our website rather at KSHB.com. The mayor plans to donate all those items he reviewed to charity. The deadline for cities to get their proposals in, by the way, is October 19th. A lot of cities are trying to get Amazon's attention, even going as far as saying they will rename their town as Amazon. They're trying to get the, Amazon's attention. That's what Stone Crest Georgia says it will do. It will be named Amazon Georgia if it wins the bid. Now in Tucson, Arizona, they sent a huge cactus to Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos. The company thanked them, but they didn't keep the cactus. They said they cannot accept gifts. Instead, they donated it to a desert museum. Leaders in Birmingham put up these massive Amazon delivery boxes all over the city to catch Amazon's attention. But it's not all quirky attention grabbing gimmicks. Some cities like Chicago taking a more business minded approach, even forming a committee to work on a pitch to Amazon. It's made up of some major CEOs like the head of United Airlines. Other states like New Jersey are working on tax incentives to get the company to build there. Even if we don't get the headquarters, Amazon still has a large presence here in the Kansas City area. There's that big new fulfillment center in KCK. Two of my cousins actually work there. It is expected to open very soon, and in fact, Amazon is hiring up to 1,000 people for a new center. You can apply online. There are Amazon centers in Lenexa and Edgerton, Kansas as well.